something very odd is happening today. Very, very strange. It's raining. Focus should not be able to power side around a roundabout. <sighs> oh. It's just so controllable. It just makes you want to do it all the time. This is a <laughs> this is a crazy car. Anyway, the subject of the video is that it's raining. I finally got a chance to try out my new tyres in the wet. The problem is, I've only got the new tyres on the back. I haven't actually been to fit the new tyres on the front. So I'm running the Cup 2s on the back and I'm running the original Super Sports on the front. I thought it was going to be an interesting day. And it has been. I've been having a ball. <laughs> This car is immense. I thought it was going to be really scary. Everybody put the fear of God into me online when I told them I'd fitted Cup 2 and they were like, oh, well, when it rains, it's going to be a nightmare. We have got no, tr no traction in the wet. Who made up that story? So when I got up this morning and I looked out the window and it was raining, I thought, oh, is this going to be a scary drive taking the kids to school this morning? Because I thought, well, with the, the rear tyres, I mean, it's raining quite heavily this morning, and I thought with the rear tyres, being the Cup 2, I thought, everyone said this is going to be a nightmare in the wet. But look, this is a wet, really sharp right-hander. I mean, there's actual G-forces there. Shouldn't be possible. Shouldn't be possible. So I thought I was going to be sliding all over the place with these rear tyres because of the wet weather. But it's just simply not the case. Those tyres back there are still, still incredible, even in the wet. So what's it been like running the Cup 2s on the back and the, the Super Sports on the front? So I thought there was going to be less grip at the back. I thought I was going to be really sort of oversteering everywhere. I thought it'd be quite tricky in the wet. But actually it's been the reverse. I've had more grip on the back and actually I've had more understeer today and in fact I'll try and show some shots where I've been trying to like make the car go into oversteer and it's been a lot trickier than it normally is so if anything they've got more grip a lot more grip even in the wet and that was a surprise I spent half the day going round and round and round with this car trying to understand where the limits are in the wet and I haven't found them. But I can tell you that when it was raining very heavily earlier, I didn't feel any aquaplaning or anything. The car was still really good. It just, I, I, words fail me. I was expecting it to be really bad. I was expecting it to be really scary. But actually, all I want to do is just slide it everywhere. It just, the, the difference is, it's just really control, it's, it's a really controllable slide. When you manage to finally break the back, it goes out, but it's, you can just catch it very easily. There's like, there's no like, you know, brown pants moment. It's just, it's, it's easy and it's fun. It's really, <laughs> I don't know how to describe it. I wonder whether to put the other tires on the front now. It has been a really, really fun day. I've really enjoyed it. So the verdict is that the Cup 2 tires are very sticky in the dry and they are still very sticky in the wet too. The other thing that really I've noticed today more than anything else I think is, is really that in the wet, and this is, this, is, this in the wet 
is better than any car I think I've driven in the dry. Oh, police, police, police. I wasn't speeding though. So. The grip levels in the wet are out of this world. I just, I think it's because of also the ease with which you can, I just, it just grips. And then when you want to have a bit of fun, you just press that accelerator that little bit more and you've got this really controllable slide. It's just, I, I can't imagine there's a lot of cars you could, you could easily do that with in this sort of weather. So if, if you're worried about putting Cup 2 tyres on the car and you're worried about the, the rain, the wet weather performance, don't be. This is like, you've got, there's more grip here than you could possibly ever need ever in a million years well maybe not a million but in a long time i will in a couple of days i will get the new tires fitted to the front so i'll have the cup twos all round. it'll be interesting to see how the car behaves then i'm assuming it's going to be more neutral because at the moment it sort of it definitely goes into understeer a lot more and then eventually i can push it into oversteer there's a ferrari 599 coming up Honestly, this car is just crazy. Crazy in the words. I've never known anything like it. There we go, but by Fezza. Oh, 599 GTO. Right, I shall be back shortly and I'll give you an update of what it's like with all four Cup 2 tyres. And in the meantime, if you haven't, please subscribe to my channel bloody hard work putting these videos together <laughs> um, appreciate anybody that subscribes and supports the channel always thank you very much and I'll see you very 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 shortly